and a fellow I've also worked with for 25 years. Add up their experience, more than 50 years of putting up with Michael Martin Murphy. <laughs> Gary Roller on the bass. <laughs> the first people to explore this part of the country were the French and the Spanish. The Spanish people were the first people to bring horses to North America. They were also the first people to bring cattle to North America. We cowboys, it'd be nothing without the Spanish people who brought the two things we love the most to North America. In fact, to the Western Hemisphere. The horses they rode were beautiful white stallions. You didn't bring some old nag all the way across the Atlantic on an old ship. Those Andalusian stallions sometimes mixed in with other horses over the years and became what we call the Mustangs. There were once millions of them until they rounded them up for dog food. There are just a few left. In the Old West, there were so many that sometimes an anomaly would happen in breeding and you'd find a beautiful white horse once again born out on the prairie. These horses inspired the imagination of the Indian people, the cowboys and all the pioneers and the farmers whenever they heard about a magnificent ghostly white stallion galloping across the plains. Some tried to capture this stallion, but it could never happen. He would rather jump over a cliff like that big granddad bluff and die at the bottom than give up his liberty and his freedom. He was like Patrick Henry. Give me liberty or give me death. The legend grew, and the story goes that the pacing white stallion of the Llano Estacado and the Great Plains would sometimes come back in the night to take somebody away from their troubles. My grandfather told me that story. She comes down from Yellow Mountain On a dark flatland she rides On a pony she named Wildfire A whirlwind by your side On a cold Nebraska night They say she died one winter When there came a killing frost And the pony she named Wildfire Busted down his stall In a blizzard he was lost the dark of the moon I planted But there came an early snow 
been a hoot out howling outside my window now six nights in a row she's coming for me Folks from the great state of Texas, where they'll someday put me in the ground because that's my home state. And from the high mountain country where I lived for so many years, Nuevo Mexico, Nuevo Mexico. Thanks, y'all, and hasta luego.